Uh, race one, we had a really good race. Team New Zealand led around the first mark and led the whole race. We luckily just popped ahead and, and were able to secure second. Race two, it didn't really go to plan at all. We got rolled off the start line. We're in last the whole race, trying to catch up. This is not a position we've ever seen these guys in. They've all, if they've gotten behind, they've always been able to battle back. Yeah, the other guys just got that little bit of pressure, that little acceleration right on the gun, and, uh, and that put us out the back. And uh, we ended up getting, we were finished last across the line, but uh, Artemis got a penalty, and I think they had to refinish, and uh, so I think we beat one boat there, so a fifth place. Last race was a, a good one for us. Pretty good start, but unfortunately we got overtaken um, at the first reach mark. We did an early jibe out and it really worked for us. We were able to uh, get the clear air and we led to the bottom mark. But now every boat on the race course has their downwind code zero up and being utilized upwind in this light air. We made a few errors up the second beat and uh, we, we actually dropped the code zero, which probably wasn't the right decision to do. All the other teams left it up and gained on us. No acceleration for these guys either, painful. And uh, Ben Ainsley Racing was able to overtake us and uh, we finished second. Ben Ainsley Racing, they just, they sailed cleanly today. I mean, in the first race, they, uh, they were back in the pack and they sailed well to get up to third place, I thought. And then the next two races, as they were plain sailing out in front and uh, no mistakes, and it meant they didn't fall into the big pack chasing and stayed in front around pretty much every mark and uh, no one could catch them. A 2-5-2, we're, we're in the hunt and uh, double points tomorrow, we'll catch up.